it is very very educative for you to understand the risk of electricity and how to bypass it and solve majority of things you spend huge amount fixing so welcome back so in nigeria our electricity is not stable at all in foreign countries majority of the electricity is stable and therefore they do not bother much on the voltage that comes into their house much but in nigeria because their light is not stable i just want to create an awareness so that you understand and get something to protect your appliance something to monitor your appliance and i want to first of all start with this the electricity that comes into your house as a unit is being measured one of the unit is a voltage and you have to understand the voltage that your appliance need to survive we have a voltage range of 0 to 260 and one of the units we use in measuring this electricity is voltage now when it comes to 0 to 100 volts 0 to 100 volts is is very risky so if the voltage in your house is between 0 to 100 is extremely low is very dangerous none of your appliance will be able to withstand it even in these modern days that they use this chopper the chopper cannot be able to withstand it the next set of voltage is 100 to 150 that 100 to 150 is majority stabilizer can work effectively there but as from 120 that is where effectively stabilizer works some stabilizer rating are rated from 100 to 260 but at that point of that 100 you can't make use of it because some of them will give you 200 it's not up to stable voltage now that 100 to to 150 is very risky let me say 110 to 150 is very risky therefore you need stabilizer because any voltage at that point that comes into your appliance your appliance suffers a lot in the next video i'll be telling you something you just need to know about voltage and current so that you understand when you are running your appliance at a low voltage now from 151 to 200 is low also but majority appliances like your television set work with that and can still work with that and still work effectively but because majority of these choppers these days or the power in that electronics can withstand a low voltage so it can withstand from 150 to 200 and it's also low but the normal voltage is at from 210 to 240 the uk standard is 220 to 240 so when your light is between 240 220 to 240 it's very much okay even 210 is still okay and it can still roll effectively so any voltage above 245 250 is going high when it goes above 250 is high voltage 260 is high voltage 270 is extremely 270 280 is extremely high voltage don't go there i will advise every home and every house in nigeria also add something you use to monitor your electricity which is voltmeter some of you have it in your stabilizer some of you have it in your power surge some of you you can just buy the voltmeter and use it to monitor your voltage in case a technician come to your house to work and ask you is your voltage low or high you can go straight to the voltmeter in your house look at it and tell him the voltage is high the voltage is 240 the voltage is 180 the voltage is 200 that's nice so the technician will have an idea of what you are having and from there you can diagnose whether that voltage is sufficient to power that appliance or not and that is why inverter ac these days suffers a lot in my subsequent video i will tell you more about how inverter ac suffers on that so once again you can get something like a digital computer like the one you are seeing under below here or you can get the other type the one i use if you can see here this is an automatic changeover i used in my house when they bring light and the generator is on automatically switch over to nepa 
without anything shutting down in my house. So it's automatic. The TV, fridge and other things in the house can still be working. So this is my... I ordered for this type. I think you can see the foot meter there. So, once again, if you are yet to subscribe to my YouTube channel, please do subscribe to my YouTube channel. Click the notification bell below so that we can update you of subsequent video. Once again, I am Robin C. Egwe. This is brought to you by Robin Tech Electric. Thank you.